What's going on guys? Steve here from the checkpoint. Welcome back to Hello Neighbor, kind of. This isn't what you're used to. There's no neighbor running around. There's no glitchy little boxes and stuff like that. No, there's just a lot of buttons and stuff here. And that's because this is the Hello Neighbor modding kit. Now, if you don't know, Hello Neighbor dev uh, the Hello Neighbor developers rather uh, and Tiny Build have launched their own modding kit for Hello Neighbor, which means you can make your own levels, you can make your own custom maps, you can do your own things, make your own situations, and they've kind of released it to public as part of a competition. You can win a lot of dollar if you make something good. Uh, today, I'm not going to be making the custom maps. Instead, I want to kind of look over all the hidden levels available in uh, the mod kit because there's a hell of a lot. I have downloaded a couple of custom maps. Um, probably not going to look into those today. Probably going to look into those in a separate video. But what I wanted to do is just go through all of these. This is every level that you can play in Hello Neighbor right now, which is quite exciting. So, should we just go from left to right from uh, Alpha 4 Golden Apple down to Trailer? Might as well. Let's go for Alpha 4 Golden Apple. Now, it will take a while for everything to load up and stuff like that, and I'm not even sure if it's going to work once we play it, so let's see how we do. Let's press play. And it should load up right now. Come on. There we go. There's the little splash screen. Hi, Crow. How you doing? He looks very happy today. All right, so here we are in the first map, which is Alpha 4 Golden Apple. It's looking very dark. Oh. Uh, there is something up there. I seem to have fallen through the world. Uh, <laughs> this probably isn't the best place to be. Don't go into the light. And the light's gone. What is that? Am I getting close to it? Oh my god, this is like being hypnotized or something. Is this like Morse code? I seem to be getting closer to whatever this light is. Um, are we eventually going to reach it? Come on! You can do it. We just gotta believe. Believe with me, everyone. I want all the comments to say believe. Believe! Nope, it's gone. Okay, well, this is uh, Alpha 4 Golden Apple. Can't say there's really too much to be seen here. So, shall we move on to the next one? Let's move on to the next one. So, the next one we have is Alpha 4 Intro. Now, this should be fairly familiar. Ah, yes, it is. So, um, this is obviously what you get at the start of the Alpha 4. Let's load it in here. Uh, I also noticed that it says VR game mode at the bottom there. Maybe they're planning on doing a VR expansion of Hello Neighbor. That'd be horrifying. Imagine the neighbor, but like actually there. That'd be terrifying. Okay, so this seems pretty bog standard. It does look a lot like... Ah, so this is where the letter comes through. You know, in the letterbox where it comes through at the start of the game. Right, this... Uh, Telephone is magically flirting there. The power of telephones, I'm telling you. Technology has uh, become quite uh, quite the marvel. Uh, so it doesn't look like there's anything here. I believe that all this stuff, like the doors flirting and the phone flirting, are part of how everything spawns in. Like it spawns in and then drops to the ground. We've still got the old pizza clock here, though. Come here! I want a slice of that pizza. We've also got the horseshoe, which did fall off in the uh, the trailer, I believe, in the in the intro. Uh, it's a level I'm, I can't quite remember. Oh, and we can fall out. Okay, there we go. Goodbye, world. It was nice knowing you. <laughs> All right, so next we have apartments level. Okay, let's do it. So this is apartments. Uh, there's also apartment evening scenario and apartment night scenario. Uh, not entirely sure what those could be. Oh, uh, okay. So is this the other part of the intro? I believe it is. Let's load it up. Hello, neighbor. And we'll see how we do. So this, as far as I am aware, should be the apartment from the start of the game. Uh, from the intro again. See, this is a nice little comprehensive look at everything Hello Neighbor. Like, all the... Oh, light. Okay. Ah, so it's literally just the intro. Okay. So it looks like we spawned in a cutscene. I don't think we can... No, we can't move around. Yep, so this is literally just the intro from the start of the game, it seems. Unless there's anything hidden here. Nope, seems pretty bog standard. Yep, there's the door. Does the horseshoe fall off? I can't remember. Uh... Ah, there's the big slammy dot. Yeah, it does. It gets moved a little, and there I am, flailing around. Well, that's cool. It's cool to see a little behind the scenes of the uh, of the levels here. And where's the letter? Boop! There it is. 
Wonderful. And do we have any more to do? Yep, so it's literally just the start of the game. Awesome. So I guess this is pretty much a finalized part of the game now, which is cool. Didn't know if it was just going to be an Alpha 4 thing or whatever. So it's, it's cool to see that it is accessible in the modern kit. God, look how terrible he looks. I mean, he has just woken up. I probably shouldn't bully him too much. Okay, let's move on. So next is apartment evening scenario. I imagine this is just the same as the last apartments thing. If it is, we can just skip through it because, you know, we've already seen that many times. Okay, so it's loading on up. You can see it in the background there very slightly. Is it just going to be the exact same thing? Is it another cutscene? Oh! What? I'm just flying. I mean, it is the evening, so maybe they were planning on doing like, I don't know, maybe like a, uh, a, a day and night cycle. It's literally just flying in open space. Am I in heaven? Is this heaven? It seems like it. All right, let's move on. So this is apartment night scenario. I do wonder if it's gonna be exactly the same as the evening one where we kind of just fly in the air. It looks like it from what I can see right now. Let's just load it up. And are we literally just going to be falling through the night? Which sounds very poetic, very beautiful. Uh, yes, there is something. What is that? Is that my nurse? Ah, uh, you can see right, like, right up there. Look at my buggers. Hey, this is kind of cool there. It's like we're in space. Whoa. I mean, it'd be very beautiful if it wasn't for this big nurse in the middle of my screen. Ah, uh, disgusting. All right, so next we have basement. Okay, so it's kind of, it, what I'm finding really interesting is how everything's loaded into different maps and they're not all part of one big map. You'd think that's how they do it, uh, but let's do it. UEDPC basement. Again, the lighting needs to be rebuilt. So uh, maybe, I don't know, maybe it's all gonna be screwed up once we get in there. Uh, let's go back into the basement. How are we gonna do? It's loading on up. Da, 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 da. Hurry the hell up. Come on. Oh, here we are. Oh, okay. This is rather loud. Is that the neighbor over there? Is this something we've seen before? I think this is part of the Alpha 4. Now, I never actually managed to finish the Alpha 4. That's the only thing. So this is all new to me. Okay. Oh, there is an umbrella up there. Ugh. I probably need that. So I think this is just part of the, like, uh... The finale of the game. Uh, as I said, I never really got to the ending of Alpha 4. Um, was this the one where it glitched out on me? I can't quite remember. I've been playing Hell and Ebb for so long. Um, but, yeah, I'm fairly certain this is, like, the uh, the basement level. If it's not, then, uh, obviously, I'm a, I'm a moron. Uh, come on. Okay, I can't pick that up. Should I just make the jump? Maybe I should just leap onto there. You ready for this? Here we go. Huh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, yeah. And I'm dead. The game's crashed. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure if that's completely new. Oh, no, we're back in. Yeah, not sure if this level's completely new. I'm fairly certain that's been in the game before. Um, I'm trying to... What I'm trying to do is get on this shelf so I can jump on that shelf, but it doesn't seem to want to let me get up there. There we go. Okay. Now can I... Uh, oh, yes. There we go. Use it. And then I guess we just fly across. Maybe we can jump from this top shelf and get all the way along there. That'd be awesome. That'd be rad. Okay, let me... Head up here. Come on. There we go. Always a struggle with Hello Neighbor, eh? I don't think I can actually climb up there. Maybe it's just a, a big run and jump. Here we go. And then jump and make sure it's done. And we almost did. We almost got across. It looks like we can maybe fly somewhere. What's over here? Oh. Okay. I'm just looking at all these little nooks and crannies that I haven't seen before. Right, well, I'm going to die, so let's just pop that away. There we go. Uh, let's try one more time. One more time at this. It doesn't look like we can just jump directly across. Maybe we do have to jump... Oh, where am I? Here I am. Maybe I have to jump for the fan with the umbrella and then jump across. I don't know. Um, this isn't really a, a gameplay video anyway. It's more just doing a comprehensive breakdown of all the levels you can access. Here we go. Jump, float, and... I'm screwed. You can see under it at least. Okay, let's move on. Let's move on to the next level. So that was basement. Now we have credits, which obviously shows right at the end of the game once you've finished it. So this should be interesting. 
I wonder if it's literally just a cutscene. It might, it might just be a cutscene. But there could be something hidden in there. There could be something hidden in all this little nooks and crannies of the credits. You know how in Marvel they have the after credits? Oh, there could be something here. Let's see, fingers crossed. Please don't just be a cutscene. It's just a cutscene. It's literally just a picture. Well, thanks for that. That, that. That's lovely. I really appreciate that. It looks very nice. What else do you want me to say? Uh, well done. Bravo. Next, we have E3 trailer final. So this is actually going to be the level that is played during the E3 trailer, which should be really interesting for a little behind the scenes look at how they made the movie magic happen. Let's just uh, go in here. Come on. Where are we? Are we just flying through space again? Oh, there is something up there. Hmm. Well, it looks like we can't access it. A lot of this uh, video is just going to be me falling through space. I hope you guys don't mind. At least I tried to keep it entertaining. I mean, we can have a little look around in the actual uh, Unreal Engine um, editor here. You can see there's not really much to be seen. Uh, I guess it's just like a... Uh... Oh, yeah, so that's where the lighting comes from. Yeah, there's there's nothing really too much to be seen. Oh, is that the... Hello, what are you doing there? Oh, look, there we both are. Kind of hanging out, flirting in the air. <laughs> Let's just see what it looks like from the other side. It looks like they're actually working together. That's pretty cool. Because you, you don't really know the... Oh, there they are. Oh, he's got a, a an eye on him. He's like, ah, oh, that boy here. He's a trickster. I don't trust him. That's what it looks like. That's what I imagine the neighbors sound like, by the way. Pretty much like the governor from The Walking Dead. Where's this guy looking? Is he just looking? Oh, hello. How you doing? How you doing in there? You good? Oh, he's covered in yellow now. Sorry about that. There we go. You look great. All right, now we have E3 trailer part. Not sure how this is going to look. Um, it looks exactly the same. Is the uh, other level says so the re I'm not sure if there's much point looking at this one I think this is pretty much just used for cutscenes. So uh, oh look, we can get a nice overview of the house here Wasn't that delightful? Uh, let's move on to the next one. Just a short little look now. We have empty level now Hmm, I wonder what this one could have in it <laughs> Empty level, okay. Well, uh, we could already see is there any point going into this one? I'm not sure it looks pretty empty to me I guess this is where they do like all the testing for the AI of the neighbor and stuff. That might be an idea. Uh, now we're getting into the real juicy stuff. We have Fear Darkness. Now these are all the levels where, um, where the, the, the like the hidden mini games. I guess I never really got into this as well. Um, but now it's my time. Now it's time for your boy Steve to take a look and finally get what he deserves after years of slogging away on this game. Let's have a look. Unless it just follows me through the floor again. Which I probably will. Oh, so this is Fear Darkness. Oh, we're tiny. Oh, this one's been seen a couple of times, hasn't it? I remember, yeah, everyone was getting, like, real hyped up about it. Now, I haven't managed to see it before because, um... Oh, God, we're tiny. Because uh, I'm not really into the whole hacking part of Hello Neighbor. I don't really like it when people hack the game and get to places where they're not supposed to go. I mean, this is obviously a, a licensed and published tiny build thing that they've added in here. So I feel fine looking through the mod kit and stuff, but um, when people use like trainers and hacks for it, nah, that's not that's not my favorite thing in the world. Ooh, what's through this door? Yeah, I'm not really a fan of that sort of stuff. Like uh, the game will come out and people will be like, oh, we've got a hack for it already. And you're like, ah, well, that's great, but uh, that's just not my style. Now, where are we going? Oh God, what was that? Oh God, it was a dream. It was all a dream. So I guess that was a dream sequence. And so now we're just in the starting cutscene, aren't we? Oh my God, it's so laggy. Oh, <laughs> he just fell over there. Oh, he's so embarrassed. I just caught you slipping, dude. Yeah, I definitely remember this cutscene from the, uh, the start of the game. Okay, so this is just this then, I guess. Awesome. So that was Fear Darkness. Now we have Fear Factory. We've got quite a few levels left to go. This could be a long video, guys. So I hope you're in for the long haul. Um, okay, so this one is... Uh, have we seen this before? I think we have multiple times. Uh, right, let's just press play. Uh, it's kind of nice being able to, like, dip in and dip out of these uh, levels. You don't have to actually go seeking them in-game, which could be a long-ass time with my Hello Neighbor skills. So uh, it's kind of nice to be able to do this. 
All right. So we're loading up. Hopefully it doesn't start off with a big screaming noise like it did last time. Oh, yeah, this one. Yep, yeah, I remember. <laughs> Jeez, I'm sorry, guys. Look, just leave me. Leave me be. What's kind of cool is that we don't actually die here, so we can just... Oh, why am I... Oh, God. Please don't follow me. Ah! No, it kind of freezes yet. Oh, God. What? I fell through the ground. <laughs> Are they all following me? <laughs> One mannequin's coming with me. Dude, you okay? Oh, no. Nah. Oh, we're falling into the sun. Why not? Here we go. Well, that was kind of cool for the short amount of time that it lasted. All right, now we have Fear Hospital. It can't find some assets, apparently, while we start, so this should be interesting. Have we been here before? It looks like a lot of stuff is missing here. Um, okay. So what I think this was is maybe this was in a past update, and since then, obviously, since they've updated the game, they've removed those models, so they can't find the assets. So I wouldn't be surprised here if we just spawned in open space. Because, uh, yeah. Yep. There we go. So it looks like there was a lot of stuff that was in the, uh, in there, but since the update, they've kind of removed that. So, uh, I guess, goodbye, cruel world. There's nothing to see here. All right, so the next is Fear School. Now, I've definitely seen this one before. This was actually already in the, uh, the Alpha 4, I believe. So, uh, once we get in, this is the one with the mannequins, right? That they're all, like, running around and, like, hiding and stuff. I'm pretty sure I remember this one. So let's see how we do. Come on. Are we going to load in? Yes, we are. Yeah, there they are. Those lovely mannequins. Ah! They're quite scary, actually. Oh, my God. Yeah. Uh, so that's that one. And it's pretty much impossible to do it. I think there is somewhere to do it, but... I'm terrible! God, they're actually quite scary. Okay, let me leave that. Okay, next we have Fear Supermarket, which is another one of the little mini levels. I believe this is the final one we have to look at. And then we have stuff called Final, Final Battle and all that. Yes, this is definitely one. This has definitely been done before. But because I'm such a nice guy, we're going to look at it anywhere. Even though it's already been done. Okay. Should be loading. Splash screen. Mr. Crow. Mr. Neighbor. I wonder what the neighbor's actual name is. Leave your theories down below. I'm, I'm, I'm really interested to see who can come up with the most imaginative name for the neighbor. Alright, yep, this is definitely a thing. Definitely a thing that we've seen before. You've just got to push it along, right? Can we jump in it? I don't think we can. It's very loud. Good grief. Why is it so loud? Let me turn that down a bit. Oh. Oh. I think one of the mannequins is mad. Just doing my little shopping here. You guys leave me be. Oh, God, we've got to keep it moving. Uh, and they got me. Uh, so that's cool. And then you're kind of lost without your thing. I wonder if we could just run straight to the end. You will never catch me. Watch these skills. Here we go. Ugh. This one's coming around here. I'm going to snake through the middle. Can't handle this, guys. You can't handle the speed. The speed of Steve. Here I go. Oh, man. We done it. We done it. We're so good. Unfortunately, we don't have our thing to get through to the end. So I'm just going to run through. Thanks. Uh-oh. Uh. 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 Ah! All right. Next, we have a map called Final. We're getting into the last few ones here. Uh, so let's make these quick so we can round off this video without making it too long. I think these are the really juicy ones, though. The really interesting ones. Load warning. Uh, warning the animation. Fireworks. Final animation. We've got a bunch of animations that I'm missing. Okay. Oh, this is interesting. Have we been here before? Whoa. Ah, it's this one with the giant neighbor. There he is. Okay, this is going to be fun. Yep. This is, uh, this is the one. Where is he? Where's the big boy? There oh, God. I saw him for a second, now he's gone. Let's just work on getting the, uh... Oh, hi. Hi, just don't mind me, I'm just gonna hit, hit the, hit the hoop here. Okay, that was embarrassing. Don't look, don't look at me, you're putting me off. Oh, God, no, 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 please, no. Okay, let's hide under here. He can't get us if we're under here. 
Oh boy. Is he got a door on his back? Oh, he's mad. He mad. Okay, let's get moving. Whoa. Everything's so giant. This is crazy. Can we get up here? We must be able to get up here. This must be the way to go. Come on. Huh. Uh-uh. Can't quite leap up. Let's try again. We need something to climb up with. Let's take a box. All we need is a box. Sorry about this. Okay. Let's pop this down. Huh. And then we jump on the box. Jeez, come on. Then we jump over onto the... Nope. Okay. Might need another box here. You never know when you're going to need more boxes. Let's pop this down. Huh. Leap onto the boxes. Leap across. And then... Ah! Damn it. Okay. I think what we're going to have to do is grab these boxes from behind once we jump up. Like so. Put them here. Oh, no, that obviously didn't work. Well, there must be some way we could do this. Huh. We can't just jump up. You know what? We're just going to charge at the neighbor. We haven't got time for this. Take this! Ah! Uh. I think he kind of enjoyed that. Okay. Um, right. This is wild. What's this? Oh, pardon me. Where are my manners? Good grief. Okay, next we have final thing. Don't know why this is called this, but uh, final thing. Oh, oh, this is the one everyone's hyping up, aren't they? This is the one with the crazy, uh, the crazy shadow thing. Yeah, there it is. Look at it. Look how insane it looks. So this was originally planned to be the final ending of Hello Neighbor, but they had to adjust it at the last minute. So this is what this is. Okay, let's just press play. This is going to be awesome. Yeah, I'm in, I'm in the Discord for Hello Neighbor, so uh, they actually mentioned that um, when people found this, they were like, everyone was panicking. They're like, oh my god, we spoiled the final end of the Hello Neighbor! But it turns out this is a scrapped thing. So this isn't the final battle. This isn't the final ending of Hello Neighbor. This is just a thing they were implementing at one point, and uh, since then they've kind of uh, stopped doing that. So here's the neighbor playing with his trucks, having a good time. And uh, where's Mr. Shadowface? That's his official name, by the way. You enjoying that? You enjoying playing with your trucks? Come on, you little big babby man. Let's move. Okay, so nothing seems to be going on. Oh, the, the neighbor is on the move. I repeat, he is on the move. Oh, what? Did I just die? <laughs> Only I could die while looking at a custom map, for God's sake. Okay. Hurry up. Do your thing again. I'm sick of waiting for you to finish playing with your trucks. Ooh, what's over this way? So it just looks like there's many, many rooms. Here's all the stuff. All the neighbor's stuff and things. All right, let's get back there. So hopefully we don't miss out on anything. Sorry about that. I was just exploring this giant house. Okay, now where are we going? He's like skipping along. La, 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 la. He's so happy. What a happy chappy. Now where are we going? Over that way? He kind of pointed. Thanks, man. Unless he's going... What? You alright, bruh? Oh! Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Now where's he going? Uh... Dude, you've spawned something in! You've spawned something crazy in here! By breaking that vase, you've released some sort of demon! Who'd have thought that something so small would do that? That's crazy. Oh, he's up there. All right, neighbor. Let's do it. Okay, we're good, I think. I think we're good. Oh, God, are you all right? Oh, dude! The neighbor's dead. Th there we go. The, na the neighbor has been murdered. Well, we saw it here first. <laughs> um, I believe there are full playthroughs of this on YouTube already, so if you want to see the full version of this, then uh, make sure you do. I'm unfortunately quite... Yep, there he is. I'm unfortunately quite strapped for time, so you're going to have to... Uh, um, Look at that in your own time, but I'm sure people like Burner's Tank and Niflick have done their own videos, so go check those guys out. See how nice I am? Okay, let's move on. So now we have final battle scene. Interesting. All right, let's keep going. Uh, okay. It's literally just a door? Interesting. I imagine this might be a cutscene, actually. All right, here we are. Oh, it's literally just a cutscene. Oh, I think that was the ending. Like, the, you managed to vanquish the demon, and now there's a door at the end. Neighbor? He's gone into the light. Oh. 
I've been left. I'm coming. Ah. And now what? <laughs> now you get a cutscene. I think this is where the credits will be, right? We vanquished the devil. Well, whoever that was. I imagine the devil. Mr. Devil. Gotta show him some respect when you're meeting someone for the first time. And then... Oh. I think it was all a dream, guys. I seem pretty chill with the fact that I just came face to face with the devil himself. Now I'm leaving? And now I'm just walking into the distance. Man. So I guess this is the final cutscene of Hello Neighbor. Right? Um, can I... Nope, can't move about. Okay, so that kind of links back to the credits. All right, sweet. All right, now we have Golden Apple for a level. And then after that, we've got the main levels, which I imagine aren't... Ah, uh, this one looks pretty... Pretty much the same as the empty level. Let's just go into play just to check, but... I wouldn't be surprised if it was just an empty level. For testing. And we are literally just falling again. It's nothing... Nothing here. Okay. Well, another empty level. Well done. Right, so I imagine the rest of them, where they say main level, are just the, um, the levels from the main game. So there's no point in looking at those. Um, we got main level, main level day, main level ending, uh, main level evening, main level intro, and main level morning. Uh, and then after that, we've got start and trailer, which I imagine are the, uh, the, the start of the game and the trailer for the game. So uh, we're just going to quickly zip through the main level, and then I think we're going to skip over the evening ones. Maybe we'll have a look at ending, uh, but mainly I want to get to the start and the trailer one. That missing one there is actually a custom map that I've got loaded up. Didn't seem to work there. Um, yeah, so this literally looks just like uh, the, um, the start of the game. The, the, the main level. Uh, there are some rooms up here that I haven't ever been in. I don't think. Oh, and uh, have I been in this one? I'm not sure if I've been in this one. Um, yeah, I don't think I've ever been to the very top as well. Much more skilled players than I have managed to do that, but uh, I haven't. So this is what the view's like from up here, eh? There's also like another building over there. What's that? That looks like a secret level or something. Like a secret. It looks like a school almost. I think it is a school. Let's check it out. So it looks like the neighbor's house is just up the road from a school. Um, what does that say? Is it in Russian? It's in Russian! Paktua Nauka. It looks a lot like a school to me, or an orphanage, maybe. Um, there's lots of the trucks out there. Okay, let's have a have a little peeksy inside, shall we? I wonder if there's something in here. Uh, nope. There's no interior for it. Okay, well, cool. It's nice to see a little look at the map. It's really cool to see how far the game's coming along since the uh, the official alpha, uh, the the not the official, the initial alpha. Um, it's cool to see they've kind of fleshed out the world a bit. Awesome. Well, let's go to the uh, main level ending now. I believe it was called. Uh, we're not going to look at evening, intro, and morning because we've seen all that before. Um, and then I guess we'll just look at. Oh, so this is. Oh wait, no, this is what we've just seen, isn't it? Do you know where it comes out? Yeah! Yeah, it is! Alright, cool. Well, I wonder if there's any secrets hidden in, he in here now that um, the ending's happened. Doesn't look like it. It looks like it's just all empty. Can we still get up the lift, perhaps? Like all the way, all the way up? There is some, like a white ball here, which is interesting. I wonder if that's like a an object they use. Um, okay. So it looks pretty empty for the most part. There doesn't seem to be anything hidden in here. It's just an empty version of the house. Okay, cool. Now we have start, which is another empty room. Okay, that's disappointing. So this is the very last map we're going to be looking at. This is called trailer. Let's see how we do. Okay, oh, it looks like the E3 trailer again. Let's press play. I wonder if this is just going to be the full trailer, like the version of the trailer in the, uh, in the E3 build. Like maybe it'll just be one big cutscene. We don't know. We won't know until we find out. It's me falling again. Of course it is. For God's sake. <laughs> there are my feet. Anyway. All right, guys. Well, that was a nice little look at the uh, 
every custom, not every custom map, every level available inside the Hello Neighbor modding kit. If you guys enjoyed this video and you found it useful or interesting, please let me know with a like, a comment, and a subscribe. Um, make sure you're checking out my other videos. I run a web series called Checkpoint, uh, where I kind of, it's like a narrative-based, story-based YouTube series that's really, it's one of a kind. I might do an episode of it on Hello Neighbor. Uh, more Hello Neighbor videos to come. If you guys want to see more, make sure you hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next episode of, well, this isn't really Checkpoint anymore, because, um, a Checkpoint is my other series. In the next episode of Hello Neighbor, if I do it. Alright guys, thanks for watching. See ya!